hundreds of protesters gather in the streets to protest a court ruling which sentenced CNRP leader Kem Soka to five months in prison for refusing to respond to a court summons. The court decision sparked widespread protest because many view it as another example of political corruption on behalf of Prime Minister Hun Sen's government. In an exclusive interview with RFA, Kem Soka said, Those who have committed these ill acts will pay the price someday. Grave breaches to our constitution along with other acts, I'm convinced, have been well noted and recorded by our people, particularly our youth. International observers are concerned about an increasing atmosphere of intimidation in Cambodia. CNRP's other political figurehead, Sam Rainsy, has been in exile since last November and could also face a series of criminal charges if he returns to the country. And questions still remain about who is responsible for the death of Cambodian activist Kem Le, who was shot in broad daylight two months ago. Soka says he did not respond to the court summons because he has parliamentary immunity. According to the Cambodian constitution, legislative members can only be detained and prosecuted with approval by two-thirds of the National Assembly. No such vote has taken place. Even when a lawmaker is innocent, if the Cambodian court wants to arrest him, he can be arrested very easily. While tensions ran high during the protests, riot police kept violence from breaking out. One protester was arrested. Lawyers for Kem Soka say the opposition leader will appeal the decision.